Hello, everyone. Welcome to 110 Second 11, the show where we examine one 110 concept in 11 seconds or less. That's 110 seconds or less. Put those seconds on the clock and let's talk about collections. Collections are the workhorse of most 11 projects. They provide a way of grouping content or data in meaningful ways. By default, this is done by providing the tag property to a piece of content, such as the front matter in your markdown. Let's take a blog as an example. Here we have a very simple 11D site. There's an index page and a folder called posts, which has our first blog post in it. The blog post has a title in the front matter and then just some simple filler text for the body. Currently, the pages are all being built. These pages all do render to the site directory, but there's no data correlation that would let us say loop through our blog post to display a list on the homepage. That's where collections come in. In the front matter of our blog post, we'll add the tags property and provide that property the value posts. This will create a collection inside of 11 with the key posts that we'll be able to access all of our blog posts via our templating language of choice. In this case, we have an index.html that's going to be rendered via Liquid. We'll use a for loop in Liquid to collect all of our posts. For post, which is the variable we'll store our post information in, in collections, that's the key, the key that 11 is looking for, dot posts, which is the tag that we used. And inside of that, we can now display any data from the post variable, such as the title in our data object. There's our new blog. We can also grab things such as the URL to create a link for the new blog. That now links directly to our blog post. So that's the basics of 11E's collection system in you know about, about 11 seconds. That's 110 seconds if you're keeping track at home. If you found these 11 seconds useful, be sure to like and subscribe. I appreciate all of that. We're gonna be putting out a regular cadence of these tips on this channel. We're gonna talk about things like 11 serverless, built-in plugins, as well as template creation and a whole lot more. So click the bell, click all those awesome things, and I'll see you later on.